Just take it down. Don't take your line out. Leave some of your line in there. If the kids are having a ball with it, and you ought to see their faces once they start getting the, the body, and it's starting to look like something, and they're walking around sanding it and holding it and stuff, and they've got a grin from ear to ear. We've been making a ukulele. A lot of sanding. Sanding is really calming. It just the sound of it, like hitting the grain. It's just, an, it's a nice sound. <laughs> it's just patience. Patience and knowing how to do it. It's really not that difficult once you're shown how to do it. You just got to be precise. Have center lines and markings you go by, and sand it up really nice. And I learned a lot about how some projects involve a lot more patience and taking your time and doing it right. I just like to see how my work turns out in the end. I like the end results. If you've ever built anything out of wood before, it kind of talks to you. And you can look at it and you can see it and you can see the different shapes and the colors and make different selections and when we, when we do some of our work called book matching it just it makes it I don't come alive. I actually have started learning how to play on the internet. Well I try to tell my students now it could be habit forming because most people once they've built one and find out how easy it is they want to build another one. <laughs>